So we are here with uh, James Lopez, a veteran Disney animator. You do Hullabaloo. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yes, yes, absolutely. I'll be happy to. Uh, yeah, Hullabaloo is uh, an independent project of mine that I came up with uh, in the interest of basically showcasing uh, hand-drawn animation. Use this. Just pull back the lever, aim and shoot. But be careful, it's got a kick. You know, we had held a, a very successful uh, crowdfund campaign a while ago and got funding to do uh, four short films. So we're currently in production on them right now, and we should have uh, like the first two of the four hopefully available for viewing sometime later this year. Yeah. Where will you be able to see these short films? Well, let's see. We're, we're working on go taking them to the festivals, so people will be able to see them around the world, and then uh, possibly after that, uh, releasing them online, you know, through streaming, um, and then. Um, maybe even onto a DVD. <laughs> that sounds very cool. So can you tell us a little bit about what Hullabaloo is about? Yeah, uh, Hullabaloo is about uh, this character. Her name is Veronica Daring, and she's basically a young scientist who was brought up in the Victorian age in which uh, you know, a woman not learning science was very popular. But she still has a passion for it and wants to do it. And so she finds that her father has gone missing and she needs to find him because her father has apparently discovered discovered a very new uh, power source, which is very secret. And so she's in the interest of finding out what it is, and she's in a race against time with the uh, adversaries to find that power and uh, do what they want with it. So it's kind of like an adventure series, uh, kind of like in the superhero theme too. So so to kind of help her along, uh, she dons on the costume of Hullabaloo, is what she calls herself as her superhero name, and fights crime. And one of her uh, main nemesis is, is the uh, Cheshire Cat, uh, you know, from Lewis Carroll's Alice in Wonderland uh, fable, so yeah. So all of your characters that I've seen in your drawings and posters and stuff, they're all very, like, they're just so well-crafted oh, and they look just so great. Who's your favorite character to draw, though? Uh, in the show? Uh, you know, that's a hard one, uh, you know, because I, I, I like the Cheshire Cat. It's really fun. You know, I like I like drawing uh, sinister characters, you know. But Veronica, I think, is a really favorite of mine. And she's really actually modeled, inspired after my daughter, I think. That's how I kind of came about. Because when I, when I saw my daughter and she was so into, like, you know, doing things like, you know, crafting things and stuff like that. I really wanted to create that around her. So that was really the inspiration there, yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. Just one more thing. So Hello Blue is kind of a steampunk kind of thing. Uh, do you have any favorite steampunk books or movies or anything like that? that you yeah, you know, I, I've always loved steampunk. And, 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 and long ago, you know, I, I actually never knew what to call it really until recently, you know. I mean, I've always, I guess, considered it to be kind of like Victorian science fiction, you know. Uh, but I really used to like, well, 20,000 Leagues, you know, Disney's 20,000 Leagues is when it first caught my eye. But I also really used to like the show, uh, The Wild Wild West, the 1960s era show. I always found it really neat, you know, the whole, you know, juxtapose of like modern day technology in an old world setting. And so, and I used to love like, well, even the remake I thought was pretty fun. I also used to like the show uh, A Guilty Pleasure uh, Voyagers, which was a, a TV show in the 1980s, which was about time travelers who uh, traveled through time and had a correct history where it was wrong through the use of a little uh, pocket watch device called the Omni. And it, it was really fun. I mean, it's very fantastic in its way, yeah. Okay, well, thank you so, so much. Well, and fun. I'm so looking forward to see what you come up with with the videos. Great. Well, thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. So that's all for now. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, Periscope, and like us on Facebook. Subscribe to us on YouTube. And check back every Thursday on comicmix.com for new videos. Bye!